Hi, and welcome to A1 Keyword Research Tutorial. This tutorial will cover um, page analysis, keyword density and keyword prominence, whatever you want to call it, and you can also do this analysis side-wide. However, we'll just begin by analyzing a single page. I've typed in microsystools.com, I click get active address, and just for a moment notice that we don't see words, words like and, or, and stuff like that, that's because there's automatically an ignore words or stop words filter in and A1 Keyword Research is able to to see that the page is in English and has automatically selected the English ignore words filter. So uh, yeah, and we can see this is like a total, the star, which holds both 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 word phrases, but you can also see it like this. No, we see uh, if you want two word phrases, it's here. Sitemap generator, keyword research, and so on and so on. There are just some uh, quick things here, because you can actually also enter your own, or copy and paste your own content, keyword text, whatever, like say we want to write Microsys tools are great, and then we'll just add microsys again. We can also say analyze raw text. And we'll just go up to a single word and we see microsys counted twice. Okay, so um, uh, moving on. Moving on. Um, you can also see that you are able to define importance to different elements in the pages yourself. Like I have you know, A1 keyword research defaults to weigh titles very high and headers, um, which gradu gradually is uh, weighed less and less. You know, H1 counts for more than than H3. Normal text, anchor text. That's you know, if you have links on your page, still those should also weigh some for your own page. But you can turn that down to zero if you want. Image alternative text, uh, t meta description, you know, whatever meta keywords I've even given it 0 0.1, you would probably put that to 0, zero if you feel like it. You can also use this for a great uh, quick building keywords, just analyze active address again, and then we'll just do like say okay space but no new lines and then uh, we'll add comma and whoopty you got yourself a lot you know all the keywords ready to import as tags or whatever you want you can also say okay we don't want comma we, we want space we don't want yeah we don't want new lines and then can we can have different length immediately, immediately available to us I think that concludes this. Ah, just remember one thing: you can actually do this analysis side by side. So, if you want, just you know, scan your website in the scan website analysis, of the scan website tab, and you can view results for all pages in your website. Well, that concludes this tutorial. Bye bye.